Okay, I don't know jack crap about this camera. <laughs> so here we go. <laughs> As you may know, a year ago, a little, actually more than a year ago, I made over my library and it started. It was like a six month long process, okay? And I did a few videos and the official tour of it came out about this time last year. In that time, there are some things that I have wanted to change and upgrade or just do something different with. And the main thing is the corner, this corner back here. Um, I ended up filming in front of it a lot more than I anticipated. As you can tell, there is a wall of Funko Pops there and I'm not really, it doesn't really fit the rest of the room. And while I love the collection, it is a Harry Potter Funko collection and I no longer endorse that on my channel. So I don't think I need it in the background of my videos and I feel like I can find a home somewhere else in my home for that collection. So I'm just gonna put them in storage for now until I figure out a different place to put them or until we get a bigger house because I just keep filling it and filling it and filling it. I'm gonna take those down. We're gonna fill it. We're gonna fix the holes and whatnot. And then I think I'm gonna put a little gallery wall there. And then I have some other updates that I need to do. One is the rug. The rug is disgusting because someone, Miss Ma'am, decided that this rug was great for peeing on. So it's become quite a problem and it smells. So it needs to go. It's also not a super expensive rug. And I found one that has a little bit more color because I do think there are times where it's just like kind of monotoned in here. So I want to bring in a little bit more color so I have a new rug to put down as well. And we're also going to deep clean the floor here. So there is that.
this wooden one which I've already replaced the picture with with a picture of Frankie actually that my coworker did for a program and then a frame that was kind of matching in wood and then this is just like a page I ripped out of an old children's book that was in the garbage <laughs> at work one day so I did um, clean these up a little bit then I found this now this is a plate I thought it was a picture but it's actually a plate and I just like the, the colors in it. Um, this is sugar and spice, apparently. And I am going to paint up the, I guess the, whatever that is, the, the trim or whatever. This is empty. This. I have this. Some plates. I do feel like I have enough stuff to put on the wall. I just, um, I have a lot of round things. So I don't know how that's going to look. And um, I'm just so darn happy. I made this myself. And I'm just like so happy with how it turned out. I love it. I love it. Some of these, I have to add something to the back to hang them from. So this is one. I think I'm gonna add something to the back. This is just like a plastic plate. And then um, some of these don't have backs on them. So I'll have to All right, I feel like I just need to take a moment to tell you why I picked this rug. Apparently it is already cat approved, but um, the reason I mainly picked this rug, one, it's a lot brighter than I was expecting. A lot of the reviews were saying the orange was really muted. They lied, I feel like, cause this is a lot brighter, but I'm really into orange lately. I just really love it. Um, the reason I went with this rug in particular, which you may have seen, it is quite thin. It is slightly smaller than my last one, but this is a washable rug. I'll be able to throw this in the wash anytime someone has an accident and is mad at me for whatever reason. Are you liking it, Mr. Gray?
don't you know that you're my lighthouse when it gets dark? Don't you know how much you make me smile? You say you're not worth much, but I think you're worth much more than my while. Won't you run away? Oh, though you're not happy in the place that you stay, so. I realized I changed my outfit like <laughs> seven times in this video. This took place in like 24 hours. I don't know why I had to wear seven different sweatshirts and whatnot throughout this process, but I just want to stop in and just to give a little bit of, you know, end, end thoughts, but I'm really happy with how the space turned out. It's really warm now. I feel like it was just missing that warmthness before somehow. And so it feels really warm and cozy. I mean, the Christmas tree probably helps, you know, any, any type of tree, uh, trees, any type of trees, any lighting, I feel like just really works, but I don't know. It just feels really cozy now. And I'm happy that I have a gallery wall started. It looks probably a little sparse to most people. I've left enough room that I feel like I can grow and add new things. I have my eye on some artwork that I want and some pieces to hang on the wall. So I'm glad I've got a starting point. I also just kind of did some little decorating here and there, but I think my next area to focus on is going to be the office area just because um, I'm not really sure. I don't mind the arrangement of it right now, but I, I don't know. I would like something just a little bit more on the storage side. I don't need as much space to work, so we'll see. That will be a future project maybe, but this is the end of this video and I'm really happy with how it turned out. You will have seen it in a few different lightings, which is why the lighting looks weird in a bunch of different shots because it's winter and it gets dark really early and then I was filming some things quickly in the morning and then some things in the evening because it just looks cozier. So the lighting is never like 100% what it looks like in real life because in real life it is just so cozy and I just can't capture that on camera. Anyway, let me know your thoughts on just this quick little update on my library. So a slight little tiny makeover that I've done and how you feel about it. What would you do in this space if this was your space? So hope that you all have liked this video. Don't forget to subscribe to see future videos from me. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!